Episode 8, To See Justice Through. Where do you wish to go? A driving while texting monster? What? A litter bug alien too? And even the disrespect the elderly gang? Ugh! So many evildoers appeared while I was off serving justice elsewhere! Um, don't you think they're a little too petty to be considered evildoers, Peori? Of course not! It's little evils piling up that lead to secret organizations being founded! By taking care of the small things, we'll bring down the hammer of justice on these sad villains of modern society! Hey, you won't get stronger if you're always dealing with the small fries. No! We can't overlook even the smallest of evils! As proponents of justice, it just won't do! As a member of the Prism Rangers, I will see justice served! This is how things should be, right, Noboru? It's time for corporal punishment! In the name of justice, I won't forgive you for littering! Preemptive strikes lead to victory. I'll kick this suspicious fellow from behind. <laughs> Justice prevails. Hey, how long are you gonna be messing around? Just power up already. Don't rush me. Said I understand how you feel, but this isn't something you can force. I have to take down the God of Destruction as soon as I can. I don't have time to waste playing hero. Playing? Did you say we're playing hero? I am not role-playing as a defender of justice. This is not some game. W what's wrong, Peori? Prince Ed's lack of grace is nothing new. True, true. It's best to just let it go in one ear and come right out the other. No! I can't stand by quietly after he called this playing hero! It appears he struck quite a nerve with Peori, and the absolute last one you'd ever want to at that. That's right! I became a Prism Ranger in order to preserve justice, and by doing so, carry out my brother's will. If I let you treat this like some game, I'd be letting him down. Brother? You have a brother, Peori? Yes. My brother was the previous Prism Red, Noboru Nijino. He fought for the sake of justice. And it's my fault he's dead.
Where do you wish to go? So, your brother was a prism ranger as well, Piori? Would you be willing to tell us what happened to him? As Prism Red, my brother was admired by everyone. Kids everywhere wanted to become a Prism Ranger because of him. He was a brother you were proud to call family, I see. Exactly. But tragedy struck on the day of the final episode. I was kidnapped by the secret evil organization, and my brother came to rescue me, defeating them one by one. The leader of the organization attempted to take everyone out by self-destructing. My brother suffered a fatal injury while shielding me. And just like that, he... So your brother met with a tragic ending. How awful. It was all because of me. It's my fault my brother died. That's why I have to see justice served. For the kids watching the show. And also for Naboru. Hmm. So that's the reason why you are always making such a fuss about justice. Yes, I've been desperate to defend justice, just like my brother tried to do. After intense training, I finally took the role of Prism Red, and did my best to carry on his legacy, fight after fight. Thanks to all my hard work, I was slowly starting to be accepted as the second Prism Red. But after repeated losses to the God of Destruction, our ratings plummeted, and the Prism Rangers were all but done for. That's when I met Zed, and he told me that winning was justice. It really shook me to my core. It totally reeled me in, and I actually thought, he's right. There can be no justice without victory. But to be honest, I'm still not sure what justice really is. <laughs> Lost sight of justice, Prism Red? You're that nameless underling from before! That's all in the past. You see, I have been reborn. Empowered by evil to teach kids right! We are... Vile Villainy Super Squad Ruffian Rangers! Now, get lost! Are you trying to take on the role of an entire Ranger Squad all by yourself? It's so sad. I don't need your pity! Because it hurts my feelings! Instead of worrying about me operating alone, why don't you worry about yourself? Your screen time's almost up! What do you mean by that? The powers that be have already decided to cancel your show! What? What did you think would happen? Your squad lost to the God of Destruction, and then you, Prism Red, disappeared! This can't be happening! What will happen to the mantle of justice I was supposed to uphold? <laughs> You're actually worried about that? Aren't you the one who abandoned it in the first place? A half-hearted hero like you needs to be beaten into the ground by the vile villainy Super Squad Ruffian Rangers! <sighs> You're not half bad. For a traitor. Who are you calling a traitor? Seriously? You're the one who betrayed the hearts of all the good kids out there who looked up to your squad. No, I didn't. As a Prism Ranger, I never stopped pursuing justice. Are you sure about that? I'm not going to let you pretend you forgot what you did. First, you stole the Secret Evil Organization's ultimate weapon. <sighs> Second, you left the Secret Evil Organization intact without defeating it! Th that was because we were in a hurry! Third, 
You didn't even hesitate to use the ultimate weapon, even though it could have destroyed the world! And to top it all off, you launched it up your enemy's beehole. That's a tactic only the lowest of the low would use. Ugh! I just got swept up in the heat of the moment! You would do anything to win. Do you know how much you hurt the kids who looked up to you? You've changed. Well, he does have a point. Uh, I've let all the good boys and girls down. You've completely abandoned justice, and you still think you have the right to call yourself Prism Red? to go. My actions were hurting all the kids watching the show. Zed, this is all because you taught her that victory is justice. You've been a bad, bad role model. Just shut up! I only told her how the real world works. Justice doesn't mean jack unless you win. You can't protect anything if you lose. You fool! What part of that is justice? While strength is necessary to see justice through, you also need a great deal of compassion to protect the weak. A great deal of compassion? Huh? Hmm, so in other words, there's no justice without power. But there is also no justice without compassion. My, my, Marjoline. Despite that childish appearance of yours, you truly are a wise soul. <laughs> she hasn't experienced over 10,000 years of life for nothing. <laughs> I don't have time to sit here and let some granny tell me off. I'd like to lecture you some more. It appears we have company. Hmm. They look like thugs employed by Ruffian Red. Perfect. This is my chance to prove that winning is justice. No justice without power. No justice without compassion. My brother was always fighting on someone else's behalf. He was always giving his all to protect others. He was stronger than anyone, but he was also very compassionate. On the other hand, I... I... Just what have I been doing this whole time? Goodness. Peori, lift your spirits with a pirouette! La la la, come on and let us sing a duet! I'm sorry, Prism Princess. I failed as Prism Red. Prism Zed, I entrust the rebirth of the Prism Rangers to you. Knock it off, will ya? Don't just throw all that crap onto someone else. He's right. Did you not intend to see justice served as Prism Red because your brother could no longer do so? But he said the show was getting cancelled. Ruffian Red's got a point. I have no right to speak of justice. 
<laughs> it's still far too early to be giving up. Come, everyone. Lo and behold! Uh, uh huh? Ultra Chroma Power Squad Prism Rangers, the movie! Prism Rangers versus Ruffian Rangers? <laughs> Changing the script is no trouble at all when you've got the power of money! Go forth, Prism Red! Vanquish the Ruffian Rangers! Your victory will ensure the Prism Rangers return! But that just means the Prism Rangers will use money and violence to return. There's no justice in that, is there? <sighs> Quit being so picky! You just have to win! Zed says things will be fine as long as we win, but... I think I need to find my own answer. What does justice mean to me? Cheers. 